Hey, how's it going, everyone? We are back with another Daybreak box. Got it from Paladins. We got our Curvus. I'm not going to open this one, but we're going to go ahead and rip into this box and hope he pulls just as well. I've been on a hot streak on Stellar's, so we'll see what we can get out of this one. There we go. All right. So let's get right into it and see where our, get our box stopper is. It's got the chronodial out of the last one. Hoping for something, maybe something a little different. Or I'll take another chronodial, I guess. But let's see what we get. Another chronodial. All right. That's all right. I like chronodial. I like that art a lot. So. Let's jump right in and get these packs going. So, I'm really definitely looking for another Ash Rabbit. Uh, but, let's see what we get so I can build decks for tonight. Get back into those uh, weekly tournaments. So, we're going to start with Boltuga, Baravib, Fountain Guide, Mermaid Coal, Hum Burst, or Bust, uh, Rock. Gnomon Dial, Leo Bright, and a Dense Fog. Uh, really, I, I want to pull Arcolith, uh, a couple other cards, but oh, Owl, that's nice. Bucky, Pandalunce, Mudlet, Boltuga, Barabib, Leo Bright, Ruminous, Soul Socks, and the Kerbis, their first hollow. Really anything. Uh, the full art would be, you know, something cool. Uh, for the spirit, I'll take another album to be honest, but again, that Leviathan would be nice. Let's keep it cruising. Lycoris, Vertuka, Swarm, Wimp, Guardian, okay. uh, and another Golden Fleece. That's my fourth Golden Fleece. Not the most exciting card. Ooh, oops. Uh, another Leo. We can go through these pretty quick. Uh, Super Tuga. That's my second one of him. But hopefully this weekend I'll have the rest of my stuff from Elestrals. Get those tournament packs. Pretty excited about that. Some blisters and our starter decks. So stay tuned for that. And uh oh there's the Ash Rabbit nice. And uh in the comments below, let me know what you're most excited about building. Uh there's so many so many decks that get really big pushes out of this set, but I know that we're in a little bit of a still metagame right now with the fives being so dominant and a lot of the decks are struggling uh, to just get over that that stat line, but let me know. Uh, see if you got a good solar deck going. I want to try a uh, Lustragano and Celeste Leo, so we'll see. Onto it. Ooh, a Cypermel. I do want more Cypermel, so that is good. My Ash Rabbit over here. At least gives me the two Ash Rabbits I like to I want to run in my decks. I would like a third just to have, but I think two of Ash Rabbit is going to be a good number. Because you don't really want to see him too early, you know? He's a good uh, mid to late game card, so keep it going. Another Alloon. And Crowdot. Cryoblast. I think that gives me my second set of those. That seems like a pretty damn good card, actually. Because not only does it destroy a lot of the cards in fives, but it will drop uh, Astrava down to three defense so you can get over it easily. Cyclovenom. Another Cyclovenom. 
So yeah, we're just going to cruise through this box. See if it works out the same way that they're putting most of the, the full art and the spirits and stuff at the bottom. That seems to be the pattern. Ooh, another luster gun. That's pretty cool. I like luster gun a lot. Deck I want to try, but the problem is that most of the solar one drops are just not that great to sit on the field. Like you got Lumeru who has five, you know, the five one or whatever his stat line was. Uh, but there's no like five defender. Like Cyper Mouse is pretty good because you can keep that out with with the fleece, and then you can next turn go into Lustragon. But we'll have to test around and see what we can find for a good build. Okay, and our first Nova Core. Very cool looking card, but I don't think this card's gonna see much play. Can we get a couple Arcolith out of this box? That would be ideal, so I can try some Thunder stuff. I do think Arcolith will be the premier Thunder card out of this set. Another Golden Fleece. Not what I want to see. As long as they'd ended off on another uh, Stellar, I wouldn't be too happy or <laughs> upset about it. So, let's see what we can get. Come on, Stellar Rock out of this box, too. Rhinosect. That is a deck I threw together was Rhinosect, because I got the full art, so I might end up playing that later on. We'll see if we don't get something else as we wait for more cards to come in to round out some of these. Ooh, and our first Coastal is. Not the width I was looking for, but I will take him. Another Brumalinx. Brumalinx is, uh, seems pretty good just for the stat line alone, but to be able to sit on Bruma and have your other, you know, options to start getting those frosts on the field is really good. Him and, uh, Bridge Club actually will work pretty good together. Get to your Shiver one while your Brumalinx is still out. Hopefully you lock down on that, sh uh, the Shield of Achilles. Or just lock down their Divine Rune. Another Ash Rabbit, there we go. So I did get something I needed. Which was the place of Ash Rabbit. And our first spare guys. They're cool. I think it's just really hard to play a Lunar deck right now, besides just splashing. So, Paragast maybe in the future will be better, but right now it's so-so. Another Dense Fog. Another thing I'm missing for a couple decks I want to try is uh, Argo. So, if we can get a couple Argo, I would take it, but the way this is going, I'm not sure. Cyclovenom. So I really need to get those uh, starter decks in. So next week I'll have all that stuff. Because it should be here by the weekend. And there's our third Apollo. So if I wanted to, I could run solar. Especially if I get another Cypher Mouse, because I think the Golden Fleece Cypher Mouse is actually not a horrible engine. Another Cryoblast. Uh, 
third Heliolith. Definitely doesn't look like I'm getting our fluids. <laughs> My blisters and starters, I pulled some of those next. Ooh, in the Bronto Wisp. Alright. Follow the Wisp. Interesting deck. Maybe I'll play around with that a little bit. Keep on chugging. Alright. For the fair, guys. And our first Celeste Leo. Just the basic art. Oh yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So one more hollow. Which maybe it's not stellar. And a full art and a spirit, it looks like. Oh, first Exaltus. Cycle of Venom. And then Chibatuga. Get down to the end of the box. See what our big hit is going to be. A sec. <clears throat> Another Ash Rabbit. All right. Oh, we got two sets of two. That's good. Stellar. Ooh, the Kerbis is my full art. That is a cool looking full art. What do we have for the spirit? Oh, here's the spirit. The Flermon. So I already had the promo Flermon. Now I got this version. Very cool. I have a lot of hollow flare mines, so it's alright though. And the last pack. Is it a hollow or am I gonna get one less? That's right. Last pack magic. Here's another cypher mile. Alright. Not a horrible box, but definitely not what I was looking for. <clears throat> 
the two cypher mill and the luster gun is nice and, and the apollo so i can actually run that deck if i wanted to or the celeste leo really but in comparison to my first box this is definitely the the you know more subpar one but i'm still very happy with that i got my three ash rabbit and uh a lot of cards to build with and we'll see what else we pull and if we don't pull the Arculus and other things I need, then I'll have to trade for them online. Thanks for stopping by. We'll see you this weekend with more product. And uh, maybe I'll have a deck profile later on for you. So tune in. All right. Have a good one.